Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a hair tutorial on this dolled up glamorous look that I've got going on. Um, I wanted to do this kind of old school Hollywood type hairdo because I think it's perfect for this time of year with all the holidays coming up and if you've got some holiday parties you're going to be going to. I think this look is so much fun and it doesn't take much work if you're already going to curl your hair. You don't have to do anything um, out of the ordinary besides curl it the opposite way. So it's super easy and it adds a lot of glamour to any outfit you're going to wear. So um, I think it's perfect for this time of year and it's so easy to get and what's even even better is the tool that I used um, is on sale like majorly so um, this the curling one that I used is the Lustrum set from Numi and it's a five-in-one set and what's great about this is it's five in one and it's at such a great deal. I have two coupon codes. One is for 60% off. The other is for an additional 20% off. Um, so I will link those below along with the website to a direct link to this site. So even if you're not going to gift this to yourself, which I think everyone, every girl should, um, you should, I think this is a great gift if you're looking for something unique and something that's going to last somebody for a long time. I've had my first set of Numi tools uh, for over two years now and I've not had a single issue with them. And what's great about this Lustrum set is it's five in one. It comes with uh, two or three different size wands, 19, 25, and 32 millimeter. Um, I use the 25 on my hair today. It comes with a reverse wand, which means it's skinny and on the top and it gets fatter at the bottom, so it gives you a little bit of a different curl. And it also comes with the pearl attachment as well, so that's going to give you an another type of curl as well. So, this is like a girl's dream set all in one. So, this is definitely a great gift, but what I like about it too is it comes in this case, and I actually have this out of it right now, but um, it comes in this travel case which I think is brilliant and it's got a little hook at the top so you can hang it um, but you can take this set with you anywhere and it does not take up any room hardly at all so you know if you're having to take you know this size curling iron to get this curl this size curling iron to get that curl because you're not sure what you're how you're gonna want to wear your hair all you have to do is bring this set and you've got five different size tools that you can bring it also comes with a glove which if you've used one before you may not need to wear the glove um but I actually burnt myself earlier even though I've used a wand multiple times. So this glove does come in handy because with a wand it can be tricky and you can sometimes burn yourself. So it comes with that and you won't have to worry up worry about burning your hand um if that's ever an issue and you know something that maybe has deterred you from using a wand in the past. So anyways, I hope that this is something that interests you. Like I said, I have tons of discount codes below. Uh, one is Santa Baby. Uh, it's all one word. For 60% off, the other is Jolly Holly. And that is for 20% off. So take advantage of these deals. If you order soon, you can get it before Christmas and get that gift maybe that you weren't sure um, about. Maybe this gave you a good idea for someone. So I hope that you guys enjoy this tutorial and I will see you all next time. Bye guys. Okay, to start off, we are going to just comb through the hair and make sure we get all the tangles out. Um, and all I've done to my hair is blow dried it. And um, as you can see, it's super frizzy and puffy and that's just what I deal with. So I definitely have to have really good tools to uh, tame this mane. But um, I'm just going to start off by taking it in sections. Um, I'm going to start with the bottom section first. I'm going to split it in two and bring both sides to the front. And I'm just going to start off by taking um, just a about an inch piece of hair. Um, we don't want it too thick, but we don't want it too thin either. Um, but probably about a medium sized thickness of hair. And I'm going to take the wand and point it down. Um, I feel like this is where a lot of people make mistakes if you're not sure on how to use a wand. That is rule number one is point it down when you're using it. Then curl the hair around it. 
Um, and once I curl the hair around it, um, I only like to leave it on there maybe five seconds. Um, this is a really, really good iron um, and it gets really hot. Um, so it allows you to go a lot quicker, but I just leave it on there for about five seconds and then once I let the hair fall, I catch it just so it stays curled and cools for just a few seconds that way. Um, and I just keep on moving forward. Um, as you can see on each side, I am curling it towards my face. As you can see, I'm wrapping it towards my face. Um, and I'm going to do that for each side of my hair. Um, so once I get this side done, I'm going to move to the other side and wrap it towards my face. And that is the trick with this. Normally you would wrap away from your face to get any sort of traditional curl. But for an old school Hollywood type curl, you want to curl towards your face. Um, and this may take a little practice because sometimes I actually forget what I'm doing and curl the other way just because I made it such a habit. But make sure you curl towards the face and this look will be super, super simple. Just going to continue to move up the head and taking section by section. And like I mentioned earlier in the video, I am using a 25 millimeter wand, um, which gives it that uh, just traditional size curl. You don't want these too big or too little, um, but you want it to have a nice curl to it. Um, and the longer the hair is or the shorter the hair is, the more you need to adjust. But as we get to the top of the head, I'm doing the same exact thing, but I'm just going to try and get more of a uh, wave at the top. And I'm going to do that by taking the hair in the opposite direction and then taking the wand and curling it the same way. And on this side, we want this curl to kind of come out some. So you can see how I'm holding the wand out a bit. Then we're just going to let these curls dry for it or dry, cool off for a minute. Then I'm going to take any regular brush and comb through these curls. Um, I feel like this is kind of what gets it that. Um, piece together really wave type look and then I'm just going to take my fingers and start um, messing with it and kind of piecing these curls how I want them. To add some more shine and um, help my ends not be so dry and look so dry, I'm going to take some of this Argan Oil from Numi and I'm just going to run my fingers through the ends of my hair um, to help the ends look a bit more shiny um, and then I am going to take it all throughout just to add shine all through my hair and it allows my hair to look more healthy. So I find that using any type of oil but especially this argan oil um, will really help um, give it that shine and just top the look off. So once I've got my curls kind of set how I want um, I'm going to add a little hairspray in the places that's needed and just adjust the curls how you want and then you are all done. I hope that you all enjoyed this video and I hope that you all are having a great holiday season and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.